Well, Kevin, two wins in your first two appearances for Blackpool. That's not bad going. Yeah, it's really good going. Two clean sheets as well. So, um, yeah, no, it's it's, uh, it's very good. And I'm just, you know, really excited to go again and, you know, keep, keep the little run going. How did you find it out there tonight? Yeah, no, I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. Um, you know, it wasn't the prettiest of games at times. Um, but, you know, there was, there was moments of, of, of quality at times. And um, you can tell that sometimes when we got the ball down and, and played a bit, you know, we, we looked dangerous. So um, definitely excited to build on that and, you know, see, see what we can do further down the line. Yeah, there's probably a lot of promise, wasn't there, in the, in the moments where you had control and composure rather than sort of get caught up into the frenetic nature of the game all around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, exactly that. And, um, but I just think, even though at times when it was messy, I still felt, felt like we was, was in control. Even when maybe they got on top of us a bit, I didn't really feel it was under too much threat. And I think that's come from the back line. They were, they were top today, you know, winning, winning everything in the air and de dealing with crosses and set pieces. So, um, yeah, even though it wasn't, it wasn't the prettiest, I still felt, felt quite comfortable. Because of the, the way that things have been with coronavirus and injuries, you probably got a taste of football quicker than you thought you would have done. But at the yeah. same time, you must have just been itching to, to start playing football again. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I was maybe, oh, I expected it a little bit, obviously, because so many COVID cases here and um, a few injuries. So I was, you know, I, I expected um, to be maybe thrown in sooner than everyone would have liked. Well, it's a step for me, to be fair. I, I would have just done it straight away. Um, you know, I've trained hard by myself so I'm always going to be at a certain level of fitness so um, so yeah I was I was all good to to start and you know play the 90. Yeah that's a big one isn't it to go and get that 90 milestone in? Yeah yeah definitely it's been what since my last competitive 90 minutes was 23rd of July so it's um yeah really really good to, to get that in. Just a shame you couldn't cap it off with a goal. I oh, know man I've got it I'm going to sleep tonight. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah man not, um, it's something that would have been nice like a debut goal and as well, get, it would have given us a bit of comfort at that time as well. But, you know, got a bit of a nosebleed and I was a bit too hot to pitch. <laughs> <laughs> and you've come into a dressing room, you know, obviously quite a few of the lads anyway, but are you, are you finding that them relationships are, are pretty easy to pick up and, and to develop moving forward? Yeah, yeah. I think um, obviously they're a good group. And, um, you know, I've been about a little bit in different change rooms in my career. So uh, meeting new people is obviously something that's quite comfortable for me. And, um yeah, it's obviously helped knowing quite a few of the lads as well, and the gaffer and and um, and Mick. So made the made the settling in a lot easier. And it's a really busy period, isn't it? It's not yeah. start one one fixture done, and then this another seven to go this month. Yeah, no, I'm excited about that, man. That's, I've been out for so long. That's all. I've, that's all I want. So um, obviously need to be careful, make sure I recover right, and do things properly to try and um, stay on top of everything and be able to to do that, which I think I will be fine. But I'm excited.